In this video, we're demonstrating how we hand carve some dolphin themed love spoons. As we've stated before, one of the great things about the Welsh love spoon tradition is that there are very few rules and regs, and that allows us to carve all sorts of different designs and very personal stories and messages. And this is a great example where there's a particular symbol, in this case a dolphin, that is important to the individual. And that then can be used as the focal point of a bespoke love spoon design. The processes that you can see us going through highlight some of the basic principles of wood carving. It's a process of doing your stop cuts, cutting down into the woods and then giving the carving its depth and its details using that stop cut as a barrier. So this example, as with most of our love spoons, it uses those fundamental principles of wood carving as its basis. Something that's fantastic about the Love Spoon tradition is that you can put messages and you can put secret messages into your design. Now this is evident on the first love spoon because we were asked to put five initials inside the hearts. Now I don't even know what these initials mean. They are personal to that individual couple. So you can put a little secret message in there that is completely unique to yourselves. It's always great for us to be doing all sorts of different designs, symbols and methods and techniques. It all helps to make the job that we do really fascinating. And that's the great thing as well then about the love spoon tradition and wood carving. It's always evolving, it's always changing and there's always something new that you can create. It's great for us as well that people give us different ideas. It allows us to challenge ourselves and to challenge the boundaries of the tradition. You're always looking for something different and something new to create. The methods then used in this case, as you can see, we've done a design on paper. We've then stuck that paper drawing to the wood itself, cut out using the scroll saw, and then it's just a process of hand carving the dolphin, the bells, the dragon, the hearts, the twists, all the different symbols that have been asked for on these two different love spoon designs. For 
those of you who are interested in having a go at making something like this, the woods that we have used are mahogany and oak. Not the easiest of woods quite often, but you do get some beautiful pieces of oak for carving as well as some more challenging pieces and the same with the mahogany. The lighter wood of course is the oak from a recycled piece of wood and the mahogany is again from recycled woods. Two good sources for getting those woods if you fancy having a go at carving them. One is from old furniture with the both the oak and the mahogany and also fixtures and frames, things like door frames, doors, cupboards, all sorts. So those are the woods that we've used for these two bespoke love spoons. So there you have it, those are our two finished love spoons using the dolphin as the central feature. It's a popular symbol that we include upon a love spoon, so if you're looking for different ideas it's a, it's a popular symbol to include. Hopefully it's useful to see something different being carved again. Thank you all again for watching. Remember, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell if you like what we do so you know when we upload another video. And as we always say, thank you again for watching. <laughs>